beautiful people what's up and welcome back to another interesting high school video and i hope that you all are doing amazing thank you for keeping up with lily and of course today i'm taking you to my hometown mm -mm, no we are not going to the hometown of my life now i'm taking you to my hometown of my former life the day i went to second day i felt like someone that is going home there's a feeling i had and i made a video i don't know how many of you have seen that video i love the place felt like i'm going there is something about there that i felt like a part of me is there this is not for the views trust me if you have watched that video you understand so maybe i'm going to link it if you would like to take a look i will leave it somewhere in the description or at the first comment of this video anyways today we are going back there so that i can show you guys this massive campus of a secondary school and a public secondary school at that in ghana <laughs> so let's go to secondary and check out saint john's senior high school and i will be back let's go founded on january 27 1952 by the roman catholic church under the visionary guidance of the late abu Porter, saint john's school began with an initial class of 47 students Initially situated temporarily at Anafo in second D, the school witnessed a significant growth in infrastructure and teaching aids with the arrival of the Holy Cross Brothers in 1957. In addition to eight mainstream secondary school programs, the school also houses a seminary for the training of Roman Catholic Brothers. Over the years, St. John's School has earned a well-deserved reputation as a respected second cycle institution in the western region and nationwide boasting a consistent 100 percent pass rate in the wasi Okay, 
for this round, statements go to each school. And contestants, you have 10 seconds to tell me whether the statement I made is true or false. If you give a correct answer, three points, so two points, not three, two points. If it's incorrect, a deduction of one point. We don't want you to guess. So if you don't know, you can decide not to answer. And that statement will be passed on to the other two schools and the first to ring the bell gets to answer, gets two points if it is correct, and a deduction of one point if it is incorrect. I start from Sunyani Senior High. St. John's School, the heat capacity of two objects are equal if the same quantity of heat results in the same temperature change of the object under the same condition. Yes, Daniel? True. Yes, it's true. A straight line has gradient 3 and intercept 2. Its equation is a straight line has gradient 3 and x intercept 2. Its equation is St. John's school, y equals 3 bracket open x plus 2 bracket close. Yes, Daniel? False. It's false. Lab it's false. St. John's School. False. Yes, it's false. St. John's School. Bromine is deposited at the cathode and oxygen at the anode. False. It's false. A preamble. A one kilogram object moves with a constant acceleration of magnitude one meter per second squared. A one kilogram object moves with a constant acceleration of magnitude one meter per second squared. St. John's School, the magnitude of the net force on the object is one newton. Daniel. True. It's true. X plus two is a factor of f of x. True. Yes, it's true. St. John's School. Honey is nectar of flowers diluted by honeybees by mixing with flowers. False. It's false. St. John's School. Arsenic is considered a metalloid. Daniel. True. It's true. Tell me this is a lie. What is it? You build a school like you built it, like your life depends on it. Kilo day. And people sit somewhere and say, we shouldn't worship you. I will. A lot of my people are worshipping you. And that is, is going to be. See, education is the tools. Okay, forget entertainment and the rest. See, as a royalty, people entertain you. Okay, do you understand? So let people be growing in music, learning, be talented and be... So they come back and entertain you to get it. Focus on this, and I love it. Look at a campus, massive, big, and uh, like you're building it so that your future generation will have less work to do. <laughs> I love this campus, I won't lie. It's green. I couldn't get that green video. So, some of the videos you see here, the people filming them use like some effects for their own, whatever. You know, maybe that's why they want the video to appear. But the real vid, like, is green and extremely beautiful and natural. Untapped beauty. Don't play. <laughs> Did I pass through there? And I saw this place and I asked the person that I was with. I said, what, what is there? He said, a school. So I thought maybe it's um, a university. So I didn't know it's a secondary school. Anyways, now that we have seen that, they are ex-students. St. John's has every race, white, black, or race, okay? They have ex-students that are 
white people you know senior old boys rather old students so they they call them old scent right it's just amazing and they still come back anywhere they are to ghana to pay homage to, to their alma mater so <laughs> let's go and check them out they are everywhere let's start with the ones in abroad or home first charity begins at home let's go home first then later we'll go out and check them out and i'll be back let's go <laughs> Eighty-five, eighty-five, eighty-five. It is also a moment to look forward at the mountains we must still climb to achieve the many rivers that we want to cross. Our purpose of gathering here is simple, to join and celebrate with us, launching the commencement of the 70th anniversary of our school and fundraising events to support the great institution and the things that we want to demonstrate to mark our 70th anniversary celebration. As a Catholic training school, we pride ourselves whereby we say when the school was established 70, 70 years ago, the purpose was to impart Catholic training on the boy child. There will be a number of celebratory events. There will be a number of events throughout the school year. I entreat all of us here and abroad watching through the internet to give us the best by contributing to the fundraising for us to have an exciting anniversary. Let us together again to celebrate a special occasion and wish the school greater success in the years to come. And I will very much stress on the aspect of the fundraising when it comes to the moment to do the fundraising. And while stressing on it, I will also appreciate all the old students who have already in many ways done so much for the school and at the moment are also willing and doing more. Thank you. Archbishop William Thomas Porter. And to the glory of God, the seed germinated, blossomed, and flourished to produce renowned personalities whose influence goes beyond the shores of Ghana. In the annals of the school, we are preparing the way, and I repeat, we are preparing the way for the 70th Jubilee celebration and to share the affairs of this function is one notable son of this great school. As I said, you begin to use this drug, your performance will go down, down, down. You may be the most intelligent boy at that time, but you will go down, 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 down. And the time comes that you realize that everybody, those who were cheating, will overtake you and you begin to realize that what has happened to you. 
So that's the way for that. Help us all to get the drug free environment, and with the drug free environment, then we can move on. So tobacco has dangerous aversion and those are the main Tobacco and alcohol are considered gain weight drugs. We begin to use them, the time comes is not enough, you move on to marijuana, the time comes not enough, you move on to cocaine, heroin, so they are gain weight drugs. So and no entertainment. It's not here that we are going to learn from your faith because your teachers are not teaching you that. So, they say, and what is the wise? That's the time. I won't dilute what I'm saying, but just take what I'm saying. This tool is aiming at showing you the way, the right way, and that's why the motto we are preparing this. Preparing you, preparing the way for you, and we're preparing you also for the side. So don't stop or disturb that beautiful motto. We are parents. Thank you very much. Saint John's, Saint John's, preparing the way. In 70 years, as I indicated, it started very small somewhere in some uh, primary school classroom. They came down here. Classrooms were built, dormitories were built, uh, various complexes. And of course, our iconic church building so came somewhere along the line. So the infrastructure, you may not say we have everything, but that is just enough to take care of the students uh, that uh, apply to enroll here. But then other aspects of our work is I just told you of the church, so we are well grounded in the uh, Catholic Church uh, faith, but then it's also liberal for other faiths to also practice their own uh, form of religion. So let me come to sports, for instance. Uh, we, by merit of the Holy Cross Brothers, and grow, based on the American model, we have, for instance, a very strong, so we have a very strong basketball team. But during my time, that is between 1971, 72 to 78 when I left here, St. John's was about the best basketball uh, school. Yeah, uh, St. John's school has made a lot of progress. Uh, we can talk about so many areas of progress. First of all, let's take a look at the infrastructure. It used not to be uh, at the, at the inception of this school, we had only four blocks. The four blocks uh, lining up here. But now, as you can see, the school has expanded. The infrastructure is big. We have dormitories, and even during my time, we had two blocks. And then we have uh, the seventh uh, house downstairs, over here in this, uh, uh, what do you call it, sports complex block, which has now been renamed the Holy Cross block. Now, as you can see, there are multiple dormitories being built and classrooms spread all over, right across the field. It used to be a, 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 it's a wooded area, but now, you know, there are classrooms all over. So the school is expanded all over. You talk about the student growth. We used to be uh, a population of uh, less than, we used to be less than 100. During my time, we were like about 700. But now I hear it's about 3,000. So the school has, is always, uh, you know, increasing in population. In terms of uh, achievements of the old students, you can you can tell they are everywhere. Everywhere you see the footprints of uh, uh, the products of St. John's. Everywhere in every company, in every institution, and even in all countries. For example, I'm, I am a product of St. John's, but I live in the United States and, and I work in the United States. So St. John's has produced and expanded its uh, influence all over Ghana and the world. St. John's School Second D is celebrating its 70th anniversary under the auspices of the Global Old Saints Association. North American Chapter will be holding its annual convention, Chicago 2023, from July 14 to 17. Chicago 2023! 
Friday, July 14th, meet and greet. Saturday, July 15th, business meeting and dinner dance. Sunday, July 16th, church service in the morning and picnic. Come and enjoy great music from St. John's Band, Matthew Chapter 5. Your MC is Gracie Coulson, Old Saint, Fiam Parante, Chicago 2023. Eventh anniversary will then continue at the school in second day from July 17th to 2010. <laughs> been able to find a video of them stating the things they are giving to their alma mater but anytime you see them gather it's definitely to give back it's, in case i couldn't get a video of such presentation know it that this gathering you see is not just for fun it's for that okay so i will go back let us go back to the school and check the guys out and i'll be back as always let's go <laughs>
Okay. I don't have much to say. This is why people are attacking Ghana. You will see people attacking when it's these are the videos that are shocking them. They can't breathe. And I haven't even gone to anywhere. I hope you tune in tomorrow to see the tomorrow video. <laughs> tomorrow video is massive, okay? Um, I hope you tune in tomorrow to see that one. I hope that you see this one and I hope that you did enjoy this video and that that's good you want to see. Don't worry. It's coming soon. Okay. I love you guys and I appreciate you all for always coming. I will see you in another video. Ciao.